and I'm just 10, 10 minutes in. My upper body is cold. Hey, what's up? Welcome back to another uh, Holy Shift video here. Uh, I was planning to go and, uh, for a short little ride with John uh, after I uh, haven't had a meaningful ride so ever since I came back, you know, the cold weather. Today's a beautiful day out. Look at this sun. Look at this sun. So he just called. We were planning to go uh, one o'clock after work and he just uh, just called me and said, dude, uh, I'm caught up in work. I can't, uh, you know, can't go. So I'm not going to skip this uh, beautiful weather. going to take the bike out for uh, a short ride. Oh my God, look at my son. Look at my son over here. He likes to make fun of me. He likes to make... He likes to make fun of me uh, talking to the camera. Okay? What up? Uh, anyway, so I'm gonna, and oh, I know why he's all excited. I have his, I have his food right here. He's homeschooling today and he's, uh, he was waiting for his food. So I went to grab it for him. Anyway, I'm uh, gonna go for a short ride by myself. Have a little fun with the bike. Uh, let's get uh, suited up Thanks. and uh, helmet up and. I am so not prepared for this ride. As you remember, I went to Israel. Uh, I knew it would be gone for a few months, so I said I probably won't need uh, uh, winter gear, you know, warm gear. So I had never bought anything. Now I'm here, which is good, but I definitely need to buy uh, winter, uh, winter gear. I bought uh, heated gloves that should be arriving in a few days from Amazon. I also bought a heated vest. It's not the Gerbing, which is the best way to go. But uh, considering the alternative right now and uh, how fast I need it and I want to do it. So I just ordered it should be coming here. For now, I'm going to be using heated gloves with my Harley gloves with these inserts inside. And I doubled up or tripled up or actually quadrupled, quadrupled up on all my layers. It's a 41 out, so it should be okay. I'm going to go for a short ride. Just enjoy the bike a little bit. This is what I'm going to use to warm uh, inside of my gloves. I'll tell you how it is. Additionally, it's a new uh, it's a new setup for my camera. I'm going to be using a full face helmet, so I have the microphone stuck in over here. Hopefully, the sound will be good. Definitely, you'll be able to hear me properly, uh, you know, uh, speaking. But I wonder if the pipe is going to be uh, uh, visible. That's the word I was missing. Audible. Opened it up. Shake, place in gloves, or anywhere you want to heat, and let's hope it works. And I'll throw one of these, I don't know, thermal warmers, Remington, uh, whatever they're called. They use them for hunting, for sporting, for whatever. Hopefully, it will provide some heat. Temporary heat till I get the gloves. Can the bike be heard? Can you hear the pipe? Well, the helmet is open now. The visor is open. Man, I miss this. Let me warm it up a little bit. No, believe it or not, these little uh, pads, these uh, thermal pads are are kind of warming up my hands. Now the visor is closed. I can actually hear the pipes very, very loud, very, you know, clear. go over here for a second
Is this any better? Is the position now any better? I think it is. Let's stretch our legs out. Get to the highway. This is a nice little park over here, a pond. You guys are familiar with this area. We're in Paramus Road that goes between Paramus and Ridgewood, going northbound now. Yeah, can hear the pro pipe. Definitely. See that ugly car right there in front of us? That's an expensive car. A G Wagon, Mercedes G Wagon. Developed and created for. Uh, some rich Arab sheiks in Saudi Arabia and the Na United Arab Emirates. Now we're going to be connecting to 17 North uh, out of uh, Paramus, going north towards New York State. We're not going to go that far. change the, the camera position right here so you're enjoying the video relax take a break oh you're like oh he's trying to push his merch again well the truth is i don't really care uh if you buy or not or if you like it or not i'm just sitting here enjoying my great coffee and my mug wearing my uh holy shift uh hoodie just looking at this beautiful sticker links down by the description <laughs> Oh, 
suck in all the uh, views and uh, smells, colors, everything. Just enjoy it. Just enjoy the pure writing. Sounds like bullshit, huh? Me and my bike. That's pretty much what it is. Nice day. It's cold, but there's not a cloud in the sky, and it's fresh air, crisp. So what exactly was going on? Okay, guys, I was back, uh, back at work after nine months uh, furloughed at home. They called me back. I did my training in Amsterdam, went for like four or five days on a simulator training, got my license back. I had to do a, some kind of a recurrent uh, course. Uh, you know, believe it or not, you forget a lot of stuff. You don't forget, you don't forget the, the, you know, how to fly. It's just like riding a bike pretty much. Once you know it, you know it. Not the mechanics, uh, the controls. That's the easy part. It is the procedures. It's the, uh, me, you know, memorizing all the stuff that you need to know by heart uh, you know the the rules uh, procedures and stuff like that that's the that's the most difficult part anyway did that and then started flying for about a, a month and then uh, things were picking up actually uh, flights out of Israel all around Europe slowly slowly picking up but surely and then the British uh, the British mutation or the United Kingdom whatever mutation of the virus when that hit everybody panicked they didn't know what was going on so immediately they they shut down uh, all transportation around Europe and that killed killed all our flights so they said dude there are no flights go home you're you're furloughed until further notice, which actually is not till further notice, it's, it's for a month. So, January, I'm home right now. Hopefully, by uh, February, they'll call me back. Because now they actually figured out what's going on with this uh, strand, with this mutation. Realizing that it's, uh, you know, it just... Uh, the vaccine is actually going to work on it. I'm not sure if they actually said that. They're... That's what they're speculating. But anyway, flights are going to uh, resume again February. And that's when I'm expected to be called back. So for the month of January, I'm here. I'm going to enjoy the bike and enjoy the family. going to enjoy friends. I'm going to enjoy the great weather here. Yeah, sure. So that video, when I put out uh, three months ago, getting back to normal. Well, it was, it was getting back to normal for a while and then there was a setback but you know nothing goes up uh, in a straight line forever Even like stocks you know there's always a pullback so the trajectory is what matters is we're we're you know we're getting out of it we're going up oh, the Sun is in my eyes it's a pleasant ride All I want to do is ride and and record. So my conclusions. This uh this uh thermal little heater, hand warmer heater thing insert inside my Harley gloves is doing its thing, it's doing its job it's keeping them warm the blood flowing to my hands to the tip of my fingers is, is warm, so I'm feeling warm actually I'm cold, my upper body vest area and my uh, knees a little bit I thought I'm saying that that's what you should do. Ride with uh, with 
little uh, bags of uh, chemicals in your gloves. But as a temporary solution, it's pretty good. All the way in. That's it, guys. Hope you enjoy this little video, this little ride. It was fun to be back. Nice and warm, not upper body. I'm Sandy from Holy Shift. Till the next video, peace out. Get up and uh, helmet up and let's get on. Let's <laughs>